Hello everyone. So, we're continuing Lu Bu. We are pushing our way into Wu. We apparently give no shits about anything, so we're just pushing our way in. So, we've got Ma Chao uh, heading here to the east. Uh, Sai Mao can only make it right here. More than likely, these armies are right here. We'll move into Lu Ko, which is fine. We'll just retake it with Sai Mao. Uh, yeah, and then move Ma Chao probably to just take over there, or I could probably move it down here as well. Um, yeah. That's basically the plan. So let's see. There's going to be at least, well, at least one battle. We'll see if there's more. Um, my goal right now is to get Chen Dang over here because Chen Dang can then grab Mr. Uh, Yan Beilu, and then that will also grab Mr. Zhu Gong here, uh, which will just kind of be nice. Um, so he's got pit baseline and a pretty decently high war value on Yan Beilu. So I'm actually maybe going to use these units because, again, I haven't used these units because, you know, like, why would you ever use them when, you know, you're playing Wu? Because, um, you know, like, so for instance, like Yan Zing here, like, that's actually a super good war value unit. Like, he's really, really good for, um, like, raids, for even, for, like, from some flexibility with aid twos. Um, you know, like, a, even, like, a fire volley. We do a fire volley now, so... Which actually probably should be one of the priorities when I do get enough craft, but the thing is, like, there's so many other things I could do with craft as well, so let's just move. Many options, many options. Alright. Ooh, nice and flat. I like flat because I am cavalry. Pretty much every single campaign I, I ended up as cavalry. I, not really the woo one, I guess I should say that. Um, excuse me, you're kind of in the way, buddy. Um, so we'll let them run into us. Oh, he didn't run, he just revived, right? It's, uh, whatever the, the horseman filler unit is. <sighs> Which army is this? I'm not actually sure who I'm against right now. Alright, awesome possum. Let's see if we can set up some juicy, juicy raids here. Give them no chance to respond. They're definitely grouped up. So this A2 is actually so good. Um... So that'll finish them off for sure. Uh, sorry, I'm just trying to think of the best way to do this. Yeah, I think that's good. Oh, does that break it? Oh. That's unfortunate. Oh, and that's actually really unfortunate. Maybe I should have just set it off. Nope, we can still... Oh, that ruins the raid. Uh, a little bit of uh, miscommunication there between the different units. Uh, I, as the commander, take no responsibility. Uh... Observe my 
We. Oh no! Well, I guess that's kind of understandable since she doesn't have the highest, you know, uh... There we go. <laughs> and that's that. So let's see what happens on the other uh, battles we're doing. Oh my goodness! Can we can we not fight? Come on guys. Come on, we're all on the same team. Come on guys, get along if you can. Oh no. It's all falling apart. It's it's all falling apart. Our empire. <laughs> C come on, man. There's no need for that. <laughs> um. <sighs> All right. Uh, Chen Dang, we are going to actually just throw in this army. Uh, probably should have done that earlier, honestly. We should have been leveling Chen Dang during all of this. Um. Is he an infantry? Like, is he stuck as infantry, or can he change the archer? Oh no, he is bowman. Nice! Okay. That makes him actually a really, really good unit. So, A2. Revive. And... Can't... Can, oh! Can we do charge? No. Okay. <laughs> oh, faint's good. Honestly, we can make him into a pretty decent unit. So these are all capped. Oh, Gaoshin could be an, a main army commander. Um, 69. Okay. So this is where we do this and hopefully get Gan Ning. It was all for this moment. Because Mr. Gan Ning is just hanging out there. <laughs> Alright, what am I doing here? Uh, Machao's going there. Uh, Sai Mao. Oh, they didn't attack. Oh, that's so good. I feel like I have too many growth items. I need to... See, this is the thing. I don't want to fight with Ma uh, Sai Mao's army. Even though it's actually, like, decent. It's just... It makes it harder. Um... Maybe I should rethink some of the units. Maybe that's why. Let's...
Oh my god, he's already at 70. That is really good. Alright, I'll fight with it. Why can't everybody just get along? <laughs> um, you know what, I am going to reinforce... This is the thing, I feel like I need to put another heavy hitter into that army, so... Just for now, we'll put... Yeah. So this will give us a little bit more flexibility, so that'll be nice. All right, how far in are we? We are ten minutes in. All right, let's let's get moving. It's going to be at least, well, could just be one battle, hypothetically. Let's see what happens. Okay, so they they did take over behind me, took over behind Lubu's army. Why the setup? I'm in the water. Why am I in the water? Oh my god, they have so many units. What is going on? So many unit commanders. Good lord. Why do you have so many units? And why am I in the water? I don't want to be in the water. The bright side, we have like 30 turns, right? So we're not in a hurry. Note to self, this is not an area that I want to be fighting in repeatedly. Maybe this is why people play infantry. They can actually get through forests. I think that's how that works. Maybe they can't. Oh, that, that horseman going in. That archer going in. I'm not going to complain. And this is why we have an extra heavy hitter. Five combo. We're coming out of the woods. All right, um, let's go ahead and just link that. One of these days, I shall get over there. One of these days, he shall get over there. Yay, arrow me, <laughs> bring me closer, yes. <laughs> Wonderful. Though, I don't know why you're just Hanging out over there, boosting and reviving repeatedly. Oh, no, not... Well, that's fine, actually. I could be easily fixed with a revive. I don't know if easily is the word, but yeah. I can be fixed. All right. So Sufe, we, that that's probably enough damage, depending upon where in the chain it is. But oh, okay. Well, that that's also something that can happen. Um, I think he actually ends up going, so I think it's okay. Yeah, he ends up going next anyway. Um. So that's also fine. Um, and this is where we... So can he do anything? No, he's not going to be able to do anything. Well, that sucks. 
This is where we model. Oh, wait, that revive's not gonna go. <laughs> oh, no. Well, family bond just saved my butt. It might have been okay. That secures it. Whoops, a daisy. I, w I don't know what I was thinking there in terms of. Because uh, we needed to start with the revive there. Whoops, a daisy. Now, the bright side, I can actually switch out of this, I think. Yeah, I can switch into a raid here. Next turn. Oh, that's even better. Oh, but that's not good. Um, okay. Actually, that's good, though. There's all sorts of things that are good, but not good. <laughs> if I revive here, it might be good. And listen here. Oh, you're just gonna sit back there and... He's loyal to himself, I love it. <laughs> I keep saying that, but I just find it funny. Okay, so that's... That's pretty juicy. Um... Surely that's worth it. Uh, maybe not. Oh. Um. Hmm. See, the problem is that this side of the map's like so. It's three units that haven't aren't doing anything, right? Like that's the crappy thing. Oh, does he not have any, uh... So he can still switch it, so that's good. Um... Yeah, so hopefully this turn I can actually do something. Maybe not. Maybe I can't... Can't do anything. You're facing the wrong way, dude. Ugh. See, this is the thing. Like, I, there we go. Now, now we're close enough. Next round, we can actually do something. broke they have 60 i guess there's always a chance they can break it i guess that does kind of make sense
Oh no! Hmm. So that kind of ruins it. So how can I... I'm just trying to think of how I can do this that it'll actually go off. <laughs> uh, because as soon as that gets affected, that'll go off. And then, okay, that, that doesn't go off either. Um, whatever, it'll kill two units anyway. Oh, I didn't even kill him. <laughs> oh, and the unfortunately the the muddle doesn't affect the only affects the the front two guys, not the back two guys. Uh, that didn't go as well as I was hoping, but that's okay. That's fine. All right. Rock slide two. Sometimes I wonder, Lubu. <laughs> you don't seem like a nice guy. All right, let's go ahead and ruse it up. Entice Mr. Ganning. Entice Mr. Ganning. I'll entice him four times just to make sure. I think that's as much as I can do. Um, okay, Lugzun is com has come out to play. Um, Simao can go down there. Macha can go there. Well, we're making progress. Wonderful. All right. Is there anything else we need to do? Uh, I don't think so. So Simao will go down here, and we will take over the Wu territories down here. Though it does look like our <laughs> our our alliance with the Liang forces is not going well. This this isn't going well. Lubu, why you, why can't you just uh, you know let people be people? Um. Okay. Wonderful. How far in are we? We are 24 minutes. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. We are actually almost taking over Wu. We've made great progress. So we'll have to fight one battle here. Uh, another, oh, yeah. So one battle here, one battle here. And then I can take over that. And same thing with Ma Chao. Ma Chao can go there and then there and then maybe come back here. Um, yeah, that's it. And I'm really hoping I can get Gan Ning. That is really the extent to which I am... Very excited um, about this. So, other than that, I'm just trying to think what. Uh, so again, Belu or whatever it is. Um, so that'll grab him this turn, and then he can grab. 
I want this uh, uh, gentleman here. I want uh, Yan Zing here with his war value. So I'm very excited about that. Um, yeah, that's basically it. So thank you so much for watching. See you all next time. Bye-bye.